Mr. Slormancer himself, Psychomantis, how you doing, man? Dude, I think you got banned from my Discord today. Um, I think you got, yeah, someone got into your account and, uh, somehow notified everyone, like, on every channel on my Discord. So once you've, once you've got it back, just let me know and I'll, like, reverse that or, or whatever. Get that two-factor added, bruh. Um, and if you were using that password elsewhere, I don't need to tell you this. <laughs> Change that shit. <laughs> Every server you're in, god damn it. Yeah. Um, but I don't think it was just you either. I think a bunch of people got... got uh, attacked. And DMs to everyone as well. Holy shit! What was the what was the content? I wasn't even awake. I, that was about nine o'clock this morning. Um, and I'm getting all these messages and phone calls like, "Dude, like something's going on on your Discord server." <laughs> I'm like, "What?" <laughs> Slept through the whole thing. Um, short stream tonight. I'm just gonna, just felt like being, I don't know, just felt like hanging out for a little bit. How's the Archer character? It's actually pretty good. I like it. I might stay with it. Um, should you buy it? The, the Slormancer? It's a hard recommendation at the moment just because of the lack of content. Um, if you can get it cheap, maybe. Yeah, Krona was one of the people that sort of brought it to... Uh, I guess mods attention or, or what, I don't know. Oh, that's right, I changed to rebound, didn't I? I don't know, maybe I want to skip to, uh, skip back to the mage. That uses way too much mana. Mana, which I do not have. Oof. Yeah, maybe we go back to the mage. Or, maybe we try the warrior. Living in Argentina with steam is kind of a steal. How so? Like, good, uh, good deals? Oh, I can't leave yet. Right. We gotta actually do some work here. Definitely doesn't feel, um, doesn't feel quite as strong as the mage, does it? I mean, much lower level too. Good morning, Connor. How are you doing? I know. Let's try the let's try the warrior. Let's give it a shot.
such heavy mana use on the on the arrow i don't understand the split arrow was dope almost unlimited this is terrible in comparison it is yeah it's not a not a roguelike unfortunately it is a uh i mean it does have this randomly generated sort of arena mode i guess that's where we're currently leveling right now because we don't have much of a choice there was a small update today i don't know what's changed there not much i don't think Yeah, I think the potential is definitely there. The upgrade system is quite deep. Um, just needs a bit of refinement. A little bit more clarity in language usage, I think. Yeah, this is this is terrible. This is not good. Maybe it's the rebound effect. Every upgrade that we've chosen, yeah. All right, that's fine. I wonder if the other, um, like, late game arrows are better, like Soul Arrow or whatever it's called that she has. She does have a couple of melee attacks as well. But that, compared to the uh, split arrow, nowhere near as good. Um, yes, we do have a skill that does like a rebound shot, but it's not easy to pull off and it's not guaranteed. It gets up to 100% damage uh, at full upgrade. leave yet not yet now let's wait for that mana all right let me make sure uh, I can unban you here uh, I don't even know where the hell banned people sit I'll have to I'll have to get back to that in a bit i don't i'll have to work out where uh, where i can see the list of of those that were banned well i'm dead okay can do better can i though that's a good question all right let's go down to see the over here the warehouse manager yeah, we want to deposit. Yeah, go go ahead. See if uh, see if you can get in. That. 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 I think that's it, really. Money. 
carries of our experience does not. All right, where's my my warrior guy? Oh, you got in? Right on. It's going to be raw damage and health, I assume. Raw damage, critical strike, that's an active. We want passives only. Attack speed, armor penetration. Oh, attack speed again? Sounds pretty good. Not enough slorm, no sweat, it's fine. All right, go through here. Rank zero, no problem. So we should level pretty fast. don't get that reference. can actually attack through walls. Okay, so let's have a look. T. Uh, raw, da raw damage. Increased armor. Whatever. Same, like, we're going to go same on all, all characters, I think, but we need damage to level faster. So that's my mighty swing. That's just a regular attack. Critical strike chance, up to 10%. A daze, not bad. Mighty swing has a 6% chance to skewer. Fortunate and perfect cast. What else we got? Projectile, wood stick. Throwing sword, projectile. Cadence, melee, a fast but light attack dealing skill damage. Grappling hook. Press shields, whirlwind. Right then, that's me sorted. <laughs> Hopefully, we can find a uh, a weapon and a new sword. Get that early if we can. Yeah, I um, I woke up this afternoon and I had a missed call from uh, Hyper Stifer, buddy of mine. You may know him 
from such websites as twitch.tv slash hyperstifferx. Um, he said, dude, something's going on in your, on your Discord. And then I had a look there and Donkey Jim had messaged me and Krona had messaged me. And it's like, oh my God, what's going on? Boom. damage do we want elemental damage here or just straight up raw damage I, I don't know because again elemental damage to me unless you're using a special weapon shouldn't be a thing with a warrior take half my health I take all of yours okay that's fine a rare slorm line fragment couldn't have said it better myself Oh, my health doesn't get refilled. I need to level to get full health back. Just like that. Critical strike chance up to a maximum of 10%. Enemies hit by a mighty swing are dazed. By 18% for 4 seconds. What, what does that mean? Dazed for 18%. Additional damage equal to 1% of your max life. Ooh. Life leech though. Oh shit. Fortunate and perfect casts. Luck triggers effectiveness. Press buttons, things will trigger. Much defense, great armor, no damage. Perfectly balanced, as all things should be. Hmm. Skewered enemies. Astral Sword, Astral Meteor. Increased experience gain. That wouldn't necessarily be a bad thing, at least to start. mana on hit okay 
fear my wood stick. Actually fear my wood stick. That it's uh, kind of great. I still think inferior flawless is a contradiction. Give me your slorm. Wow, three, three pairs of gloves. Cool. Oh, were they shoes? No. Oh. more effective mage than my mage. Murder. How would it be walking around saying what it is you do? Like you go into a job interview and it's like, so what makes you qualified for this position, McQueeb? Murder. Huh. Well, you'll be hearing from us. Uh, thank you very much for coming in today. Uh, John here, my assistant, will see you out. Hey, Ronkley, what's up, dude? Good to see you, man. The warrior feels all right. Once you start doing like big, big damage, feels better. Reaper damage multiplier, 10%. Okay. I think attack speed would be really good though. Yeah, Ronkly, you know, despite the lack of content, I, I am. I am enjoying it. I'm, I like trying out the different builds. Um, pretty fun. Very, very customizable, I think. And we've only scratched the surface, too. Like, there's a lot of content there. Half of it isn't even implemented in the game yet.
More slorms. I don't know. Everything's called slorm something. Everything's got a weird name, so... I don't really pay much attention to the names of the currencies. And then there's, like, components that make up other currency components. It's it's weird. They've, they've probably gone a little bit too far. <laughs> You, f you pick up fragments that make other components. I don't know. The cleave, the, the wide angle of attack is very nice. get a lot done very quickly and I'm all about it. So we want to get, same as always, raw damage and maybe attack speed as well. See, look at this. You've got Slorm Line Fragments, Rare Slorm Line Fragments, uh, Slormite, and different versions of that, Slorm Lines, uh, Flawless Slorm Slormite. So there's, there's a bunch of like gem-ish type things. It's a bit, it's a bit overwhelming. You wait till I get whirlwind. It's all over, baby. That's it. Got seven thousand, uh, uh, Whatever. Slorm... Slormies. Got a magic slormite. I can't even afford, believe it or not, I can't even afford to use those because you have to unlock every shop upgrade, including the ability to perform basic functions. So, uh, yeah, we won't be seeing that stuff for a while. So we should probably unlock something here. Critical strike chance. Good passive, doesn't cost any mana. Additional damage per max life. Life leech. It's always welcome. Mighty Swing has an additional 11% overdrive chance. Inner fire chance. I see. I don't want to. I don't want to deal with that. I'll just take additional damage and crit crit chance. I mean, why not? Oops.
Where's my over here? Now we now we cooking. Be nice if I could get range on it, hey. Be like uh Range on the forgotten in Isaac. And then I guess for, um, as far as, oh, I'm missing another one. As far as new weapons go, let's see if we can get something that does either raw damage or uh, attack speed. Oh, dude, don't worry about it. That's fine. Um, like, yeah, people will get over it. No harm, no foul. Mighty swing level three. That's my damage right there. Let's get a little bit more XP. Next floor. All right, let's see. Additional damage based on max life is equal to percentage of your max life, 1% per rank, up to 5%. Jesus. There's a new driver out for NVIDIA. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sit this one out <laughs> if that's all right. <laughs> if there's, if there's patch notes for it, um, see if there's anything to do with the, the monitor issue I was having. What's up, Sny Viper? How you doing? Um, what do I want to check out? Inventory. Yeah, they, they keep fucking up drivers. I mean, I'm sure it's a nightmare trying to do, especially hardware level stuff, but you'd, you'd expect more from a company like NVIDIA, wouldn't you? That's a sword. Hell yeah, look at that thing. Gold-plated sword. Thorns damage. You have plus max life. 
Max life is equal to your thorns damage. I mean, max life does carry over to my... Well, a percentage of it will carry over to... Nah, no way. No, it's garbage. You can stack other things with thorns, but we're not there yet. RTX to five new games. I don't know if, if RTX is a big feature for me. Like, I love having the power to run whatever I want at whatever resolution I want, but I don't really care about RTX. Like, the brightness of my studio lights make that kind of a moot point, in my opinion. So am I, I start it this time? Oh, hell no. No, no, no. This is a late day. Um, it's weird. I, I planned to stream and I got ready four hours ago. Five hours ago. Um, just felt like taking my time. I made a TikTok. Um, made sure a YouTube got uploaded because I've been really neglecting that, especially since the, the subathon. So, you know. Um, all of the correction, most of the subathon uh, stuff has been uploaded. There's a few that haven't been based on um, DMCA. I was afraid, rightfully so. A lot of the Final Fantasy stuff is getting claimed on YouTube, so I'm glad I took it down when I did. Not surprising, that's that's pretty common for that stuff. Edited 30 days? No, edited is definitely not what has happened. I put up um, a slightly edited one for Alex Kid, the one we played a couple of nights back. That's on the main channel, but everything else went on the second channel, um, pretty much unedited. Just broken up into segments, essentially. And I used the Twitch online editor for that, made it so much easier. Anyway, most of it's up, I've just got to figure out what's missing. There'll be the end of, like, Final Fantasy X, the end of Final Fantasy twelve. Uh, Final Fantasy 7 End, I think, is not there as well. Man, we are churning through this, huh? Level 9 already, holy shit. Does my cam block slorm? Yes, I have 6100 at the moment. So we've got 8% crit chance now, um, and way more extra, extra damage. That's all we want, is attack speed and damage. That's the same way I treated my mage, it's the same way I treated my ranger, <laughs> like... 
I'm a very simple man. Does this game have a hardcore mode? Not that I'm aware of. All oh, right, and we've got inventory stuff. No, 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 we did that. No, we're good. Does it have a rogue legacy feel? No, it's not a roguelike. It's a, it's a Diablo clone. And it is early, early access. So, um, buyer beware because there's not a huge amount of content. But I think I only paid like 12 bucks for it, which is pretty ridiculous. Um, I can see the potential in saying what I just said. I can see the potential in, in the game for sure. Am I going to be playing Diablo 2 when it comes out? No. No, I've heard uh, a lot of not great things about the remake. Um, and thinking back to the Diablo 2 community and the cheating and duping and it's just like, why do I want to get involved in that again? Because you know it's going to happen. I was, I was tempted to though definitely crossed my mind I'm just yeah after thinking about it for more than five minutes I realized that modern d2 um, never gave me positive vibes Dude, when, when Stone of Jordan became its own currency, that's when I decided to sort of start pulling back. And we're talking, that was one of the first big uh, changes to the meta, right? It looks easy. Well, don't forget, I'm on, the, I'm on zero difficulty right now. We're going to bump it up once we get powerful enough. Shit, my crit wasn't even equipped. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> uh, what are we going to get down here? Mighty Swing does 13% increased damage. As long as you don't wear any legendary equipment. Sick! Has an additional 1.5% critical strike chance. Is equal to your mastery level of the Mighty Swing. Okay. You can now charge it. Well, that's additional damage once we reach level 5, which we'll see pretty soon, I guess. I'm level 9, so soon to be level 10. Um, once we reach level 10, we can choose a specialty. That's when I have to start making up my mind there. So we'll check all the, um, the perks. Hopefully passive stuff. If attack speed is on there, we may go for that. Maybe damage.
All right, specialties. Throwing sword. Hundred and thirty nine to one sixty six damage. Fifty six to sixty seven skill damage plus bleed. Might be good for bosses. Eh. I'm all about that mighty swing anyway. So, let's have a look. Luck triggers effectiveness area of effect. Thorns, defense, tenacity, crowd control, totems. Let's have a look. Increased damage on skewered enemies. 35% armor penetration. Pretty good. Critical strike damage. Skewers can be stacked up to five times. Skewer, blocking, stun chance, critical strike damage. Whirlwind critical strike damage, okay. Piercing chance. Nah. Oh, right. Experience gain. That might be a good idea. What else we got? Astral Sword. Increased damage. Astral Retribution. armor life regeneration block stats max life 20 percent block stacks thorns damage tenacity thorns and retaliation Retaliate now deals damage over seven seconds. Plus armor minus movement speed. Increased damage, overdrive damage, inner fire damage, damage over time, and damage to elites. Up to 10%. Chest item stats are added twice. I'm going to go with this for now. Um, purely for experience gain. Fast rebound. Changed healers again? Eos, how so? What's up, Butcher? How you, how you doing tonight? Equip the XP gain? It's passive. It's already there. I can unequip it.
Reaper damage multiplier. Floor 11. How far does this go? Probably unlimited, huh? Will it have multiplier? No idea. No idea at all. No, this is, um, I bought this one myself. Uh, the devs didn't reach out to me at all. This is just something I wanted to check out. So we can afford to bump up the uh, experience and, and uh, currency gain slider a little bit. Let me go one level up. So we're going to sell what we don't need. How much we got? Nine grand. If I hit sell normal equipment. Cool. Cool. Doesn't sell the important stuff. Did I ever try games or apps which let the community make and share their games? Like Mario Maker? No. Not because I don't like the community involvement, just I'm shit at Mario. No point in upgrading those. 40k to unlock the merge tab? You're making me mad, sir. Don't like it. We're level 10. Let's see if there's anything over here worth taking from the warehouse. What's up, Heinerman? How you doing, man? 32 raw damage. All oh, right, but it's level 16. Give me that, 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 and that, and that. Level 13. I'll take a few of these. Can always return what we don't need. Level 20. It's going to be a while before we can even grab them.
20, 20, 16, 16, 12, 13. The level 12 and 13. A nice little changeover. Oh, I got it, Darrett. It's a secondary thing. I'm not really too concerned. All right, let's bump it up one. So here we go. Oh, big change. Double health, yeah, right. For 45 experience? Doesn't really seem worth it, does it? I guess the chance of finding rare stuff is increased as well. thorns damage. Well, there you go. It's a nice little upgrade. Fear my giant stick. I don't know, maybe I'll I'll bump it back down again. Not quite there yet. It's not worth it. The speed at which we're going to earn slightly more XP is not uh, not great. Mighty swing level four. Nah, we want level five. As long as you don't wear any legendary equipment. Tough, huh? Why won't you die? I 
How many are we at? Five out of eleven. I gotta close a few more first before I can leave. Very nice. I think we can leave when there's five remaining. I'm not sure if it's a percentage or a flat number. There you go. resistance and evasion that instead and what level do I need to be 12 I think 13 13 12 yeah at 12 12 and 13 and we get a few upgrades Shit. Yeah, let's not make that mistake again. Is that plus four raw damage every time? Yeah, it looks like it. Okay. zero. But why are they weaker? Or why am I weaker? Or why are they stronger? Because I'm stronger, I guess. Okay. So they scale with you. But only when you start the dungeon. So I'd be better off going as far as I can. Hmm.
Oh yeah. The life bender. Hell yeah, look at that thing. What a beast. Max damage, 799 at level 100. Something's changed. Something's changed, because look at the max damage of my current sword on the left. It's gone way down. It was like 5k earlier. What's a slore? It's a de developer created name. When have you cast a skill, you restore life plus max life. When have you dealt damage? What's what's changed here? Something's changed. I'm significantly weaker all of a sudden, and I don't know why. Give me a sec, folks. Your stats get reduced by higher diff. What's a diff? Something's definitely not working. Hey, brain dead. Difficulty. Right, but I went back to normal difficulty now, so that that should be relevant. The enemies have changed though, that's interesting. So that might have something to do with my level. Alright, as an experiment, what we're going to do is keep going through this zone for as long as I can. As far as I can. We should be... Oh my god. We should be very strong. After a couple of cycles, and the enemies should remain relatively weak, but we were we were blitzing through it earlier. I guess gear matters as well. Yeah.
What level are we? 11 still. Not for long. I don't watch these hits I'm taking. Yeah, I'm in that weird in-between zone where I'm looking for a new game to play. So like, and I know my time is probably wasted here since, you know, this game's going to change a lot before it's released. It's probably going to be years before it's fully out anyway. Um, I don't know, just looking for something new. I, I really enjoyed getting back into uh, Bio uh, Mutant. That was cool. It was good fun last night. Again, I don't care about the story at all. It's just I just wanted to mess around and kill stuff and level up, make new items, find new parts. That's all I want to do. played Grim Dawn. No, I haven't even heard of it. Ah, uh, we're level 12 now, right? Where are ya? Okay. Sounds like zombies. Is it zombies? I've played Kingdom. Kingdoms. It's alright. Bit too much uh, strategy in my town building game for me, but I can see why people like it. Actually, one of the best speedruns I watched lately was Kingdom's speedrun. It's good fun. Let's see if elemental damage does anything at all to our overall damage. I have no idea. Ow. 
I got wrecked. Cthulhu Lovecraft inspired RPG. Okay. Ah, uh, that sucked. Did we lose anything? No, we just failed the mission. We still kept all of our gold and stuff. So it's 40 grand to unlock the combiner guy. What about the blacksmith? See what he does. Reforge equipment. Okay. Effects of the equipment at the cost of slorm lines and slorm mandrites. Choose an item to reforge a recipe and start crafting. Okay, let's go and reforge uh, that. Reforge normal scores. Normal stats. Lock. Reforge magic scores. Magic stats. Oh, I don't have a slore mandrite of fate. Of course I don't. <laughs> Critical strike chance. Thorns damage. Raw damage plus 19. Lock that. All right, what ifs? Grim Dawn is like Diablo, but better. Let me see if I got it. It's seventy-five percent off right now. Oh, there's a bunch of DLC as well. Steam Loyalist Items Pack. The spiritual successor to Diablo 2 that fans have been pining about for years. One of the best ARPGs in years. Phantom Abyss just got an update. Have a look, see if I've got it. Grim. I do not. This better be good, chat. We're gonna switch it up. We're gonna go the whole way. Grim Dawn. Can I buy the whole thing? Bundle info. Wait, what do we not get with that? The loyalist packs. Much content is locked behind. Alright, we'll buy everything then. So buy all of that. Graham Dawn, Crucible Mode DLC. Ashes of Malmuth. And Forgotten Gods. Obviously I'm going to need the Steam loyalist pack because... Um, I don't know. Just add everything. What's it add? Helmets and shit. Just cosmetics? Yeah, 
It's not easy either. All right, all right. Do we want that, I wonder? Loyalist item pack two. Dark wizard, black knight. It's not classes and stuff, right? It's just, you said it's just cosmetics. No gameplay stats or bonuses of its own. Okay, never mind. It's going to take a while to download, probably. Seven point four gigabytes. Man, I ain't got five minutes to, to spare. Oh, it's transmutes. Okay. Let's wait. Seven hundred hours, Jesus. I'm going to update my, uh, my stream info here. Are you going to see it before bed? Well, it's already halfway downloaded. Yeah, I think you'll be fine. <laughs> What's this stuff I'm downloading from the Steam Summer Sale? Is this the one's badge pros progress? Oh, okay, so I still need a few more badges. Sell these cards on the market. I need the uh, action. I need horror, space, and survival. I have unlocked mystery, adventure, sci-fi, RPG, rogue, and strategy. Wait, does it unlock the what, like cards based on the games that you buy? That'd be actually really clever, forcing people to buy genres they don't really want to. Shit, it might be actually. <laughs> Story is meh, but the mechanics and class customization is very deep. Perfect. I don't care about stories in games. <laughs> Sorry to any writers currently watching. Alright, let's go into studio mode over in OBS. Oh my god. Thank you, baby. Oh, wow. Amazing. Try them first. They're what are they called? Tiny tater tots. Perfect.
All right. Just stop before two hours to refund? Nah, we don't do that around here. Actually, I did do that with one game. What was it? Oh, Final Fantasy 13. It was just a bad port. Capture specific window. Yes. Grim Dawn. Yes. Match title. Window must match title. Press OK. Help improve Grim Dawn by periodically recording anonymous system and gameplay stats. Nah, I'm good, thanks. Options. Video. RTX 3080 full screen, 2560 by 1440, anti-aliasing, yes, 8 times, anti-sotropic filtering, yes, 16 times, textures, high shadows ultra, Enable improved renderer, which increases rendering speed at the cost of using additional graphics memory. Go for it. Very high. High. Very high. Very high. Oh, got to change the size over here. Meow. Turn that off, go back over here. All right, looking good. These are really salty. I'm just gonna eat them real quick. Hopefully this runs all right. Uh, main campaign, single player, normal difficulty. Create character. Quibus. Can I not see my character? You seem surprised. It's been a while since we've had a win. How long will it hold? I've never entrapped a being like this. But the bonds hold. For now. 
How do we dispose of it? I'm just a witch. You're the soldier. If it bleeds, I can kill it. How do you kill a spirit, though? <laughs> I'm sorry. If you kill the mortal vessel while it's bound, the spirit may perish within. If it escapes... It's listening to us. What are you? Others of your kind name us the Furion. Why have you invaded our world? Your world. We existed first and were managed by your corrupt gods. Your pride opened the way, and how we return to reclaim what my life should be ours. I've heard enough of this rubbish. Let's hang it. And Barrels Charkley, thank you very much for the sub. Sub? Raid. It's been a long day. Thanks, man. Welcome in, everybody. Let's hang it. Yes, let's hang the thing that's glowing green. We've obviously found the brains of the operation. Captain! Cut him down! What? Are you mad? Better safe than sorry. The spirit has fled. This is a human now. No, you're good, dude. It's totally fine. <laughs> Thanks for the raid. The captain is correct. When they awaken, they won't remember a thing. Oh, am I? Am I the guy? The ethereal was right. The war is lost. We're a resistance now, and we need every human survivor we can call to our cause. Maybe this one here can still die with some honor. If they ever wake up, send them to me. If they don't, bury them deep with the others. Still drawing breath, I see. You're one lucky bastard, I'll give you that. Best go speak to Captain Bourbon right away. He seems to have a plan for you now that we've spared your life. Um, is there, is there, uh, was, was D controls or is it all mouse driven? Not enough materials. It would take six scrap and three thousand iron bits to repair. Hello, ready gamer. How you doing? So you're the one we almost hung. <laughs> I didn't really see a sense in it, but then again, almost hung. Let's talk about your definition of the word we almost, shall we? The captain. You'll be the one deciding whether there's a place for you here at Devil's Crossing. You can play with the controller? Oh, you can rotate the screen though. Okay. We'll see how that works with uh, picking up loot and shit. What do you mean, new audio device detected? That's the second time you've done that. Give me that new audio device detected bullshit. It's the possessed one, I'll tell you. Something that needs doing. Hey, good to see it done. Come back with some blood on your boots, and maybe I'll reconsider. Just try and make sure it's not your own blood. Let's see what's left of my wares. Oh, Jesus, that's tiny, huh? Can I fix the UI size? I barely see that. Options menu. Classic casting, classic targeting. Target lock.
Lock map rotation, yes, that's fine. Auto loop materials, yes. Uh, interface. Uh, video. UI scale. There we go. Whoa. Slow your roll. Good use. We'll see what's left of what wears. Doesn't look too bad. Player HP bar, probably useful in the interface. Alright. for someone just come back from the brink of death. You were taken, possessed by the same creatures that have been reanimating these zombies here. Normally I'd have burned you with the rest to be safe, but we've lost too many people to the dead. I need the bodies of the dead are rising again in some horrible unlife. So weird. The corpses don't just get up and move around on their own. Something is reanimating our deceased with ethereal energy. We have observed the dead for some time, and they appear to be flooding lower crossing from the burial hill just beyond town. I want you to go to the burial hill, find whatever is controlling these abominations, and destroy it. You will need to fight your way through Lower Crossing. Once you've crossed the stream on the far side of town, there will be a... Feels eerily similar to the opening of Diablo as well. Oh my god. Interface elements overlapping each other. Illusion be gone. Hundred percent I should be able to get in there, yeah. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna go level. Alright, I like the combat so far. Ding. I for inventory. Auto equip is on. Nice. Physique, cunning, spirit. One point available. Bonus health, bonus magical damage. A strong spirit increases the flow of energy into your being and allows you to withstand the spiritual burden. Of using more powerful enchanted items. Cunning. Okay. I guess I should choose something, yeah? Physique? 
strength to fight in heavier gear and the agility to avoid enemy attacks physique also greatly increases your capacity for pain regenerate your wounds and the ability to avoid being critically hit what about damage output bro Here we go. Select class devotion. Cool. All right, looks like a grind fest in here as well. I'm busy. Imperial army trained to survive in the most hellish conditions and hold the line against the deadliest enemies of the Empire. Soldiers prefer the use of close combat weaponry such as a sword and a shield, but can also prove formidable with firearms. What a soldier may lack in outright damage output is made up for in fortitude and leadership. Demolitionist. Explosives, destructive magic. Cultist. Summoning. Nightblade. Selling the use of brutal two-handed melee weapons. Easily adapts to other tools of war. There's a necromancer though, kind of my favorite thing. Necrotic Edge. Siphon Souls. Requires one point in soldier. You can you can get two classes, okay. And can these be undone or are they permanent once selected? Boy, too many choices. Oh, okay. You select a base and then you go blah, 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 blah. And these are different levels. So your, your top end skills are over here. Hey, Darrett, I'm totally okay with that. Um, reminds me of when I put a point into warmth in Diablo 2 as a sorcerer. Build ruined. Start over.
Oh, well, that's just it. I don't, I don't know how my playstyle is going to work, so... Um, Shaman seems good. Uh, and it does use two-handed weapons, so that could be nice. That combined with, like, Warrior would be pretty dope. Very strong. And we get a pet as well, apparently. Briarthorn. Soldier's a, a good multi-class. Well, let's start with that then. I'm, I'm okay with that. Ah, okay, yep. Tactician Markovian always maneuvered to strike from the higher ground. This classic attack, inspired by Markovian's battlefield tactics, features a powerful downward strike. I guess just putting basic points in would be fine too. It is my first time, yes. War cry. What's uh what's passives versus actives? Is it square versus circle? Same sort of thing? Or these are just additional Yeah, it looks like it. Okay. All right, well, I might as well just base level here. It just gives me extra shit. It's fine by me. And I still have one attribute, so... Going on a boat. Hargate's Isle. Ah, fuck. Get him. Get him. I probably shouldn't be here just yet. Level 5, right. It's fine. I got the HP to tank it. Barely. Oh boy. I need some kind of cleave. I am currently stuck here. Oh yeah, boom, motherfuckers.
Man, that um, active uh, health regen is quite nice uh, when you're technically not in combat, huh? These guys need to be uh, making a slightly different noise, like... That'll make me feel more at home. Oh, my index finger's already getting fatigued. I love it. Taking me way back. I think my... I think my dog farted again. God damn it, that smells bad. Two sets of gear, nice. Cunning. Pierce damage, physical damage. Oh, physical damage is cunning, okay. I'm assuming I shouldn't be here now, right? Into the cave under Burial Hill. No, we, we should have gone the other way. I and mean, that's fine. Better, better too strong than not strong enough. Orange equipment. I wonder what that is. Let's have a look. Polished emerald. I have to put points into the skills. Oh, I, I'm, I'm aware. I'm just leveling my passive stats at the moment. I don't really care about skills just at the moment. Serrated spike. Level 5. Oh, now we got guns, too. Eleven to twenty-nine. Fourteen damage per second if equipped. Twelve to sixteen. Do I need ammunition? Because this is pretty dope. <laughs> Lore bonus, 150 experience. I don't care. <laughs> oh, we got a caster over here. Meyer Shaman. Uh oh. Incoming. Yeah, it's time to back off a little bit. We can dual wield? <laughs> uh, 
Nice. Give you a lot of lot of flexibility off the bat, huh? Frozen heart used in rings. It's a component. Okay. Minus nine damage per second if equipped. No, only one. We we might not have that just yet. Remove illusion. I wonder if uh, leveling my cunning increases my ranged damage, which I guess it shouldn't, maybe? Auto equipped, very nice. I think it does? Pretty, pretty dope. Oh man, I'd love to go back in time and be a fly on the wall watching me play Diablo 1 for the first time. doing yeah I figured uh, brain did I figured that would be a good way of giving me all of the options available right it's gonna take me a while obviously to get there but give me all of the options available and then we can start I don't know fine-tuning from there but flat stat ups certainly don't hurt especially since everything equals damage Pepperbox Gun of Celerity. Special item. Oh, it tells you straight up which is better. Okay, that's cool. There's the serrated spike. It's a component. Ah, okay. So let's put components over here, maybe. Scavenge plating used in all armor. Right click to apply. Oh! You can just straight up add it? Impaling weapons granted by item. Empower your attacks to pierce through armor. Wait a minute. Okay. Elixir of Spirit. We're not really going to need that, are we? Wait, that's it? Nah, there has to be more here. Interesting, this is such a short-range weapon that he still takes a shot at it. That's a that's funny. It's it's simple. I like it. It's it's like that's locked. Shoot it open. All right, so we need a trapdoor key, I assume. That's it. That's all there is here. 
White, yellow, green, blue, purple. Oh, interesting. Yellow's before green. All right, we're going back. Easily shoots a door open, like it's nothing. This is pretty cool. It looks nice. What was the game that came out? Ancient game. Kind of like a Diablo style thing. Torchlight? Does that sound familiar? Scrap. Scrap materials such as bolts, leather, cord, split stacks, control click. Ruined bone of decay, magic offhand. Quartz line ain't like Diablo. Hmm, okay. Path of Exile. Well, I've, I've heard of that, obviously. Everyone's trying to get me to play Path of Exile. Minus 26 damage per second. Titan Quest. That's the one. Thank you. Ancient. Last Epoch. I actually know someone working on Last Epoch. Oh, yeah. Improvised round shields. Required physique 145. Ah, okay. Okay. No sweat, my dude. the water, that's cool. Walking dead. Pretty good, man. We're about to level. One more kill should do it, actually.
What did I need? Physique? Or cunning? Shit, I can't remember. Whatever. I can wear it with my uh, with my gun as well. But see how quickly we found gear. Like this is a game I've never played before, but already I'm like excited by what's to come, even though I have no idea what's coming big difference between that other game we were playing, right? It's like you find gray items for, for days and then you find one green and it's kind of average. No, you want to find cool shit straight away so that you're invested. You want to, you want to keep playing. Combat pants of corrosion. Look at that. Is that a fireball? Somebody throwing fireballs at me? Brood. Barog the bloodied. More like... Barog... The, the dead. Wish the graphics were better. I mean, it looks alright to me. I think I have to go back and sell. I'm getting full here. Oh, look at that thing! Woo. Hmm. Okay. Problem. And so it's just really small. There you go. I can't carry anymore. He can't carry anymore. So yeah, we're gonna go back and sell real quick. I wonder if I can carry like one-handed mace. And a gun as well? No. Open a portal for quick travel. Red portal thing. This? Oh my god, how good is that? Rising in droves and will overwhelm us with sheer the numbers. Fuck? Where did this attitude come from? Head to Burial Hill and destroy what head out through Lower Cross. Give me a good price. Left. Give me a good price.
scrap. Used to fasten together items or structures. Right, so we need that. Okay. Gonna be hard pressed to find something better than what we're currently using here. Rings, though. He wants thousands for them. very convenient and you don't even have to like get a scroll or anything to do it it's just available yeah they want to they want to get you in and get you fighting as quickly as possible it seems pretty pretty happy with that Some kind of uh, heal. I've noticed a few like food rations. You pick them up, but they don't appear in your inventory. I guess it's just a in combat style heal, maybe. Oh, they know I'm here. Corruption. Yes, yeah, we figured the uh, the component combinations out earlier. Is poison? No. Nothing. Either that or I'm already out healing it, which should shouldn't be a thing. of blood something in here quest marker maybe I'm enjoying this. This is fun. It's interesting. When, when did this come out? I guess is a, a good question to ask. Because it's interesting that I haven't even heard of the game. And yet I'm a Diablo enthusiast. Kind of weird, right? 2016.
What now I'm trying to think what else came out in 2016 that would have taken my attention. I have no idea. Can't wait to actually meet something that's a little bit more of a challenge. That'd be cool. Sky. Well, I did play it. Um, but no, it did definitely didn't keep my attention for all that long. Stardew, no. XCOM 2, again, played it. I've not for very long, though. Dungeon Siege. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dungeon Siege I played. That's going back. Dishonored? Mm -mm. Nope. Doom 2016? Nope. Plus poison damage. I wonder if that gives uh, gives me poison attack or not. Oh, I can't wear it because of that. Required spirit 88. Got it. Hmm. played Hellgate London. I spent $150 on the Founders Edition of Hellgate London. Imagine how sad I was. Hi Zog the Reanimator. Come on, Kaizog, out damage me. No? Alright, that's fine. Oh, he's getting there. Might have to fight my way out. I think I am doing poison and acid damage. Hmm. 
Return to Captain John Bourbon. Get a more manly, manly man name. Captain John Bourbon of the Cult 45 clan. Oh yeah, I'm standing in something. That ain't good. Oh, a ruined shrine. I'll check that out in a minute. Let me find these guys first, though. The shrine is ruined needs to be restored are you sure you want to place this offering yes offer offer these things yeah okay physical damage yeah i'll take that Two-handed, nine to one oh three. Cold damage, frostburn damage, poison damage, physical damage converted to acid damage. Okay. Puncturing scrap metal blunderbuss of the void. Oh, we've unlocked devotion now. Points available one. Tsunami. Hate the fire. Affinity requirements. Ah, we don't have those yet. Oh, is this the... There you go. Okay. Health. Defense. Health. Offense. Offense. Every shrine you cleanse, you get a devotion point. Okay. So what's the difference between green and purple? Ascendant. Ascendant beings have risen to godlike status through immense feats or reverence. Eldritch affinity. Wild forces of magic and metaphysical realms. Well, if I'm going to be a... Soldier... Show me these ones again. Assassin's Mark. Physical damage. Internal trauma damage. Increased armor. Complete Constellation Bonus 4. Shield Wall. Blades of Wrath. Dryad's Blessing. Okay. I 
can't carry it. My inventory is full. Let's do the red portal thing. Crossing. Oh, there's another one as well. Okay, so you can activate waypoints as well. I like it. The dead attacks have slowed and their numbers are... must be bound onto a skill or a passive from your mastery you have a chance to frock okay uh I see you around the dead attacks of a creature was doing this i need some time to plan our strategy in the meantime there are others around devil's crossing who could use your help Take a moment to mingle with your fellow survivors. Sorry, I'm moving towards stars on the map. I can't talk right now. The captain send you over? Search. Still can't get in here, I don't understand. Oh, that would explain it, I guess. Um Aha. Welcome to my work, Riftgate. You don't remember anything, do you? I'm excellent. The Ah, ah we've if you happen to find my looking for a new you illusionist oh that's just changing the look of your dude yeah okay cool Quartermaster. If your reputation meets requirements, got it. See you around. What do you want? I know these people work so hard on um, story stuff, but it's just. Just let me get back to bashing heads. Greetings, child. I am pleased my knowledge of spirits has allowed me to devise a tr I'm afraid that I troubled memories. My knowledge of spirit troubled memories.
Respected reputation is required to access the bounty table. Oh, I'll be accessing that bounty table, don't you worry. So does it mark out all of the shrines that I need to find? Something shining here on the ground. Nothing. Yeah, it's fun. I, I, again, I don't care too much about the story. It's not uncommon for me though. It's my uh, my roguelike roots. Ah, uh, that I couldn't tell you, Raven. I don't know. Yeah, something's doing poison damage. I take it it's single player only. Oh, do they keep reanimating because of the crystal? Ah, oh, that makes sense. Entrances to the same cave. No, no, I, I maybe I went in. Okay, just me. Future Den.
What's up, Rabtastic? How you doing? You've got a weird food combo? Oh, you saw my TikTok. <laughs> right on, dude. Right on. Oh, there we go. Oh, him's a pretty boy. I like him. Shit, he doesn't like me very much. I don't know if it's the environment that's causing me to take damage over time or he's like most of the enemies probably doing poison or something in here. Collect scrap for Barnabas. Oh! Did I break open something that was... I don't know. Oh, my, my weapon is doing poison damage. Okay, that's cool. Necromancer's Musty Tome of Blood. Bleeding damage. Magic offhand. Ooh. Drop some magic orb. Can I pick the orb up and take it back? Would that be a viable option? No. Seems like an odd choice then, no? Granted skills, seismic blast. Oh, interesting. Okay. Fire damage, 12% fire damage. Physical damage converted to fire damage. So what if I put... Ice spike granted by item. Launches a spike of rock solid ice to impale your enemies. 18 energy cost. Main hand damage, 22%. It's a lot of stats that I don't quite understand yet. Maybe I want to put this on... Nope. Not on that. This on that. Hell yeah. And you can only apply one thing? Yeah. Okay. And there's armor, items, and... Uh, weapon items, it seems. can't carry anymore. Try harder. Dangerous domain. Crippling. Monster attack slows op opponents, but attacks slower. Oh, okay. That's like a... Okay. This quest system here reminds me of World of Warcraft.
not by default, or at least not early on by default. They they did change it, but I had a mod that stacked all my quests up together. So the mod gave me a spell. Fire Blast. Put the spell in the hot bar. So what? Do I click on no? Right click on a square. Oh, okay. the scrap. Well, good news is I got the water pumping again. You know, since I've cleared up this key. I'll give you a good price of what we've got left. Better give me a very good price. Oh, there's two hot bars as well. Oh, look at that. Press Y to cycle. Let's have a look. Options interface. Let's turn that off and... Yes, that's fine. I don't care about numbers, really. Player health bar, yes. Pet values, no. I don't want to see the numbers. I just want to see the bar. Um... No. Gameplay. Move to breaks objects. That's fine. Okay. So I don't have enough reputation. Where do I, how do I get reputation? Just by continually doing quests, possibly? That's the way to earn reputation, be rude to people. Nice, good work, Queeb. What do you want? All oh, right, but it's not specifically those quests for those people, it's just quests and, and killing in general. Alright. What was the name of the very first den in Diablo 2? It was like something den. D2, Den of Evil. And then there was Rack and Issue by the Stones. God, he fucked me up so many times. Yeah, that's weird. It gives you some items, but it also gives you the orb which you need to break open. Very weird. That electrified motherfucker. Oh my god, kill me so many times.
Small AOE with that little fireball. It's got all the expansions. I, I bought the complete pack. Um, I don't know what the difference is. Because this is the first time I'm playing the game. Plus fire damage, burn damage, pierce resistance. There's another serrated spike. Can I add that to this now? No. Alright. Um, cunning, obviously. Oh good, giant mosquitoes. What, I pay for it? 30? 40? Total? It's not bad. Probably be even better if I was interested in the story at all. <laughs> oh yeah. Let's go, Raglas. Level 10, baby! Mutiny. What is mutiny? It's a gun. Level 14 required. And it's not very good. Okay. Leather spalders. Oh. I can wear two rings, okay. Offensive ability, sure. Battered shell. Some good stuff here. Oh wait, I switched back, didn't I? Hang on. Still more damage. Magic two-handed ranged. 17 to 107. Armor piercing. Faster. We attack. Attach this.
to that. Oh, that's shields only. Got it. Freaking badass over here. Doesn't look as cool swinging a giant bat. Oh no! Okay, these things are giving me major flashbacks to Diablo and I hate it. Most annoying enemy in the game. Good night, ready gamer. Take it easy. I can't carry anymore. Well, you're useless to me. Kind of runs back to town, huh? Not enough iron. Is iron the... I guess it's the... Uh, what do you call it? Gold, right? Currency. Did I not rescue a guy? I sense turmoil within you. Spirit guide. Not just yet. Um, I assume this is for redistributing points, maybe. Stay strong. Stay strong, she says. Class trainer. Convict's tunnel, hey?
What was the name of the desert in Diablo 2? Where the mosquitoes were. It wasn't Kuras. That was Zone 3. Luth Galane. Hidden footsteps. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Very fond memories. I always hated the, um... Fourth zone? God, what was that called? The... The, like, Ar Arcane... San Arcane Sanctuary. There you go. Um... There were some layouts that were just really bad. And then you had the, the maggot tunnels in Loot Galane. Ugh. You had to fight Duriel, and if you didn't have a shitload of defense, you were just taken out super fast. Pandemonium Fortress? That was the new zone. That was uh, zone 5. That was in Lord of Destruction. Electric Beetles? Mm-hmm. Yep. Electricity is probably the worst um, element. a unit. I mean, we don't have many attacks and whatever, but it's pretty dope. I may go for a ranged um, like a, a gunman instead of the shaman. What's up, bullfish? How you doing? Golem spell? Uh, Diablo 1. I can't remember. I do remember a glitch in Diablo 2 with the Necromancer. Um, with Bone Dagger? I think it was. It was like a thrown thrown bone dagger um it was it had busted synergies and if you had a specific pair of boots it did like stupid damage Spear. Mm -hmm. Sounds about right. I think they, they fixed that eventually, though. It was one of those really late in the game um, patches that the game received. Because people were still playing many, many years later. Did they ever figure out what the gem on Battle.net did, if you clicked it? 
Remember it changed color if you clicked it a certain number of times, but no one, it didn't do anything. It was like a meme, but it might have done something. something spam while waiting there were people that swore that it uh, changed your drop rate of certain items dang dude hell yeah lightning damage Do it. Oh, that gave me a lightning spell? Uh, I can't even be bothered. I'm switching out too frequently. Once I start actually getting a build together, then, then we'll set up some skills. I can't carry, I can't carry it. My inventory is full. What up, bro? The only skill needed is shoot or hit. <laughs> Facts, though. <laughs> Flesh bound tome of blight. It looks very good. Required spirit 174. Ah. Let's go sell it then. I don't know. I kind of like the scroll now that I've done it a few times. I like the scroll. The scrolls required to get back to town. It's like you got to prepare yourself to go back, you know? How does this thing? Illusion be gone. This vendor will not accept this. I need to store it somewhere. Do I have a chest yet? There's one up top, but I don't have the rep to use it. Top right is the chest. Alright. Uh, I went the wrong way. Uh, 
Um, I might get this one as well, just for the offensive. So I need four points. Four, 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 and four to get like this physical damage and armor. Right. Locked. Left to activate. Complete constellation bonus is four. Oh, okay. Defensive. <laughs> Get away from me with that. Fifteen cunning. Bonus to all pets. Fifteen damage. Okay. Eight health. All right. Okay. Yeah, I missed I miss Hellgate London. It was like it was great when it started. And then it just sort of got just fizzled out. Too many bugs and not enough support. But I had a I had a good time with it when I played with played it. Slith Necklace, quest item. A Slith Lord? It was a grindy game though. I think I spent a long time just just leveling in that game. Go see what's left of what wears. Vigorous claw fetish of renewal. Is that offhand? Does he have a buyback option? Yep. Right there. Let's see if I can. Oh, there you go. I don't need reputation here. I can just store it all, store it all in here. Okay. This is your account storage for, ah, uh, okay. Cool, cool. Salt bag. Less damage from ethereals. Amulet. Oh! I do have an amulet slot. I'm currently carrying my salt in there at the moment. It's very important. Okay. 
think we go north then. And buying items in an action RPG? Mm -mm. No, you must have me confused with somebody else. Who's Barnabas? What's this little gold line right here on my health meter? Like a max health, but there's a gold line right here. What is that? It's like bonus from something, maybe. Right. No, no, no. I, I, I need to know who Barnabas is. There he is. Any luck clearing out those slips? Well, thanks for all your help. Done. The gold line goes down as you region. Oh, interesting. Okay. So it's not unlimited healing. During combat, maybe. Is this the third time I've been in this cave? Yeah, it is. I shouldn't be picking up greys anymore, I don't think. Those mosquitoes, man. Ugh. It says meat, meat and bourbon inside the prison. Uh, we'll get there eventually. A lot of healing pots, actually. What was your absolute favorite class in D3? Or, or even, even more specific, what favorite build? So I've seen some awesome stuff, like the, uh, was it Demon Hunter? The Assassin, whatever. Um, like an unlimited shooting thing and it just shot everywhere it was just ridiculous and people are farming rifts and stuff with it 
solo, of course, like, wild. Oh, there's a, there's a good boy. There's a good boy. He's a good boy. Enchanted packs. Wait, Diablo 3 has a necromancer? Did I know that? I haven't played it in a long time. Um, I prefer the console version of D3. It was uh, way superior in my opinion. And it was really well su suited for controller as well. Because the drop rates, I think, were a little bit more friendly, you know? Like some kind of world event here? What should I be doing? Well, keep summoning. I'll keep getting XP. Oh, we just created a brand new, uh, a brand new portal. All right. White Mare. Corvin Basin. Oh shit. It's big. It's very big. Okay. We we going to Malmouth today. It's gonna take me a while. Necro was added in 2017. Huh. Chaos energy. Salt bag. Out time. Another serrated spike. Tolerated. They they tolerate me here. Great. Good, you're back. I, one of my scum. You've proven yourself quite resourceful. Follow the road. Still can't use the bounty table. I'll be back, but that bounty table's got my name on it. Twenty-ish hours? Nah, we'll speed run it. Don't you worry. I'm I'm halfway there already. 
a little asterisk next to that. It says, uh, this may or may not be true based on my extreme lack of knowledge of the game. Sinister two-hander. Not enough iron. Dude, you're in the middle of nowhere. You can't be charging 14,000. That's a, that's a decent used car right there. <laughs> it's right? <laughs> Fight him. Just like the Spelunky shopkeeper. Although, he's probably not a clone, so there may, no, there may not be a forgiveness option. You did, Atlas Pronto. Nice. You never forget your first. It's not true, I can't remember what mine looks like. Blood and Gorger. Some kind of debuff. Hello, Rift Hound. I don't even know where to start here. We'll get back to it, I'm sure. He ate it. Remember the game Mortal Shell? A very recent game, actually. Like an independent uh, Dark Souls style game. Don't know why, I just had visions of that whilst playing this. It's quite good. I wasn't very good at it. Last night when I got off stream, I uh, I went to YouTube and I was just watching like some speedruns, some long plays of just old classic games like uh, 
Gods. I don't know if you ever played that, if you ever had an Amiga or on PC. Uh, Xenon 2, also Bitmap Brothers. Uh, Magic Pockets. Uh, Flashback, the sequel to Out of This World. Fade to Black, which is sequel to Flashback, kinda. It was 3D, it wasn't very good. Uh, but I do remember the audio recording a hunk of meat when you picked up a hunk of meat and then a severed arm both very cool I do that from time to time just fire up some nostalgic gameplay and just sit there and watch it just like what a way to fall asleep cinematic platformers there you go Oh, I missed a shrine. I'd see it. I'd see it on the map. I think. Yeah, one guy. He's a bit of an expert at the game, and he he did a no damage hardcore speed run of like the really um, the hardest difficulty in Flashback, and he was saying it's not really a platformer because it's on a grid. It's more of a more of a puzzle game, he said. Desecrated shrine. Summon what is trapped inside. Oh, hell yeah. Let's go. If there is a cleave option, I would like to do that. Because I want to hit multiple targets. Actually, let's check that. Cadence. Magnify the power of every third single weapon strike. Okay. Blade arc. There you go. Look at that. Force weave and blade arc. Can I stack Force Weave and, like, do they work together? No, they look separate. Different skills. Did I get the first inventory expansion bag? I don't know. <laughs> From a quest? No, I don't think so. Do, do I look like I know what I'm doing? What's this over here? Oh, uh, apparently I did. Maybe I did. I don't know. Barnabas gave you. Got it. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, duh. Of course I did. Good old Barnabas. Always rely on that fella. Uh, which one would you recommend? The, the cleave option or force weave? I'm thinking physical attack would be better, but I have no idea. Oh, another devotion point. Nice. Internal trauma damage with 30% increased duration, defensive ability. Physical damage, 24%. If 
vitality resistance, cunning and spirit. Cunning. Defensive. Pierce damage, cold damage. level as force weave can take you easily all the way through to elite oh interesting okay i'll go for i'll go for this one such force is channeled into the attack that it compresses the very air projecting out a wave of energy that stuns and damages foes okay Tremor, a mighty two-hander, let rip devastating waves of energies on your foes. Minus 50% weapon damage. Rending force, internal trauma. Versus blade arc. That works with one-handers as well. 60% main hand damage. 180 degree arc, six energy. A more powerful form of blade arc in which the soldier builds more, builds power between attacks. Laceration. Strike more enemies and tear them open, causing bleeding. Sounds pretty good too. There's 16 levels of this? Oh shit. Is there like a passive just straight up damage up? Plus 15% to all damage. Can activate with all default weapon attacks. That sounds perfect for me. Oh, different techniques? No? These would these would all be beneficial, I think. And as someone that's very basic in terms of the, the skills that I like to use, might be good to do that. Anyway, I've got uh, 18 more points here to go first. That's another six levels, so. Although I might go for the arc first. Can you have it so that your default attack is... Yes, you can. Okay, never mind. Cool. So I will have to work on my spirit eventually, maybe, unless we can get gear to do that. looks recent. Sick. Point me in the direction.
All right, now I kind of want to switch to a mage. That does a fuck ton of damage. That's awesome. Two from three. Is it possible? I know you said that you can't reset a character once classes are selected, but would there be an editor out there that I could use to do that? <laughs> I just want Lightning Nova. <laughs> GRT Grim Edit. Okay. Uh, exit the main menu. Please hold. Grim edit. Um, is there an official site at all? Oh, here we go. From the command line. No, 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 no. Give me a, give me a. Oh, I don't mind. I don't mind using hack tools at all. That's fine. Save file editor. Command line tool that you look at and modify the contents of your save file. Rename character, change your level, skill points, devotion points, not a problem, specific piece of gear. Is there is there no uh one with a GD defiler? Okay, that looks like it might be the one. Got a download button. I can't stand these sites, man. These like, um, like wiki slash, um, what's that site called? Uh, GitHub sites there's you can never find the download button gd defiler here we go this file could harm my computer if i get disconnected you know why Ninety style no it seems to be like it's the way things are going you know Launch GD Defiler. There we go. Um, initialization complete. 
Good. Quebus, level 12. There we go. Iron experience. I don't want to change any of that. Attributes. Just reset attributes. We'll reduce all attributes to the original value of 50 and let and set your available attribute points to what was refunded. Please be aware that you may not be able to wear some pieces of equipment after doing so. Makes sense. Masteries and, and devotions. Total devotion points unlocked. Reset devotions. Mastery one. Remove. Be sure you want to remove soldier from your character. If you choose yes, you'll be given the option to remove all skills associated with this mastery as well. Yes. And if you choose not to, you will leave orphan skills for mastery you no longer have violating the game's mechanics. Huh. Cool. Reset devotions. Yes. Reset progress made on devotion skills as well. Yes, I guess. This is dope, man. Love it. Okay. Rift gates. Oh my god, you can edit everything. This is this is a really good program. Thank you for the for the link. All right, so I'm going to close that out. Do I need to save it? Eleven attribute points available. No, nope, looks like it's all back to available devotion points. Three. Yep. All right. Technically, not cheating. Just, just changing my mind. I'm gonna go grab another beverage, folks. Uh, give me a sec. I'll be right back. At least it's not GeoCities. Amen to that. Oh, look at him, Queeb. Yeah, I have a feeling you're not going to be able to use that weapon much. Be right back. Something didn't work. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Yep. I didn't save.
Default attack, weapon, pet attack. Now that's fine. Available skill points 34. Rift gates. Save. There we go. Let's try that again, hey? No, I, I closed straight out. I didn't realize that I had to save. Centerlink Bogan. By the way, I like your name. Not many people would get that name. I do. Oof. Yep. There we go. That's better. <laughs> oh, you in trouble, boy. <laughs> Okay, so. Noita? Like Poida? Flash freeze. Where's where's my area of effect shit? That's what I want. This is not the right guy. Him either. Where's the dude? No, no, no. I very much want um, Frost Nova or uh, Electric Nova. Must be, must be him. Did I miss it? Replicating missile. That sounds good. That's okay. They have to have a viable uh, area of effect spell. They have to. Every good game does. Star pack. Mage it up. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay. So that will be my... Oh, you don't want to be my primary tank, that's fine. Yeah, it's quite the cooldown. Uh, what can I not wear? Physique. Oh, right. 118. Well, hang on a sec. 145. I could still wear some of this stuff. Although spirit is going to be our energy region, magical damage, duration damage, bonus health. Plus 51 damage per second. Uh, we don't have the cunning required. That we can use though. Oh, that's got cold damage on it and frost burn on it. Never mind. Offensive ability, I'm assuming means what we're doing. to cold damage. Oops. Give me that back, please. Five percent attack speed. I wonder if attack speed is gonna help us. Oh yeah, and we need um Devotion. Defensive. Health. Health. Offensive. Chaos and poison damage. Type in the top center bar. Cold damage, acid damage, frost burn. 
Oh wow, we need tons of different colors. Oh, so that forces you to select different sections of the board, I suppose. Yeah. Well, there we go. Tsunami. Alright. Sure, no, I, I get that. Might have to mix and match. Alright, let's find something to... Excuse me, one second. Yep. That'll, that'll do it. Boy, oh boy, my melee damage is garbage. <laughs> yeah, take that. Yeah. necklaces do I have? I've got four. Didn't he only want three? Fuck, that's cool. <laughs> oh, you feel like the ultimate badass on the on the field. Assign attribute points. Oh, did I level again? I did. Does it change the cooldown? No, but maybe there's something else that does that. Offensive ability. Want to get that. Plus 32% cold damage. Frostburn damage. No devotion. Oh, I need to do... Yeah, right. And then spirit, which is... Magical damage, right. Yeah, somebody... Oh, there he is. What's up, fella? And now that we have that editing tool, we can try out what whatever the hell we want.
repair bridge to Burwich. Three scrap and 5,000. Oh my god, that's expensive. Some way to clear this, huh? Doesn't look like magic does the trick. Oh, it's a damage over time as well? Yeah, because it wasn't strong enough before. So what would be a good pairing for a, a mage? I mean, something with elemental damage plus as a passive would be a good start, I would say. Shaman or Inquisitor. Is Inquisitor the one with guns as well? Could be a really good pairing, actually. These bugs remind me of the ones from uh, Demon Souls. Creepy as hell in that. The hell is that? Detonation site. Not enough dynamite. Yeah, no shit. I don't have any. Oh, nice. Okay. And it is only single player, right? Like, there's no drop in, drop out multiplayer. Oh, there's co op. Cool. Interesting. Okay. What I'm what I'm finding really odd is that I'm this build is available to anyone playing the game, right? And nothing is current. Well, we do have decent gear, but it's nothing special, right? 
Now I am on normal difficulty, that might have something to do with it. But it doesn't seem even remotely difficult. So what does Veteran do? Just harder? More HP? Uderman's down there. I don't think I can get there. Oh yeah. That didn't work, eh? Something purring. Such a huge radius, I love it. Plus 16% skill cooldown reduction. What? Ah, so that is a thing. I think I've already got plus 13 if I wasn't... Let me check here. Yeah, I've got cold damage and 13% skill cooldown reduction already. Shield block chance. Let's see if any of these... Fire damage, no. Well, there's cold damage. Let's throw that on, I don't know, on that thing. And we get ice spike. Sorry, say that again. The one we had on, we didn't have that ability. It lights up in a focus because you chose that ability for your character. No, but it literally says right there, plus 13% skill cooldown reduction. That one gives virtue. Look at the line directly above it. I don't care about the virtue. It says 13%. Hell yeah. Let's do it.
Got it. Now that I understand. Plus six percent spirit. Yeah, it's probably better. That's probably better. Five percent casting speed. Energy is not presently a problem. Frost burn, cold damage, slow target. Ah, that's the damage over time component. Wow. Like this, this is already kind of ridiculous. to do in that cave. But we can't do it yet without dynamite, I guess. Leading cunning spirit, energy, ener energy regen, 18% skill cooldown reduction. Attack speed. be a hell of a thing to put like all these different zones together and uh, you know make an actual full map right oh hello traveler Is plagued dead animals just like in Diablo. around here somewhere. Resistance is right, just like Diablo, <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> mm-hmm. Easiest way to go down quickly and especially D2, it's, uh, not having resistance, especially in hell difficulty.
see what's left of my wares. Okay, back up to 9k there. That was already open, that rift. Maybe this is a place I've been before. Yeah. Yay, that's the one we need to come back to with the dynamite. So am I ha am I heading back? <laughs> yeah, okay. Okay. changed. Lightning rod. Lightning Nova. Ten percent chance on attack. Need level eighteen for that. All right, we'll keep that. Sounds pretty good. Chaos damage. Do do 850. Yes, this is uh, the first time I'm playing this game. Yeah. Plus 8% elemental damage. I assume that helps us. Is it negative 245 damage? Let's hang on to that for now, too. Elemental damage, lightning damage, electrocute, offensive ability, 
Enem energy absorbed from enemy spells. Physique one, two, three. We'll get that next level. Blueprint. Guardsman's Defender. What's this? Right click to learn. Okay. I can now craft that. Hmm. So is it possible that this is far superior? What's my damage now? Offensive ability, 406. Oh, that doesn't actually change. Oh, that's like my skill. Damage per second. Here we go. 147. 392 over here. Maybe it's because of this, though. Alright, well, well, we'll get onto that later. It's fine. Be your armorer. Together we will strike back against the invaders and retake Cairn for humanity. I will see that his work benefits humanity. Could use your talents. Side with Angren. Open rift gates. Oh man. Moral decisions. Now I kind of wish I was reading. So Bourbon let you stay. Bah, man is far too trusting. You'll slip eventually. Don't be going far. My noose is lonely. Your overacting is showing. So Bourbon let you stay. there a quest guy I'm supposed to give these uh, things to? Maybe it's the wrong. The slithered neck necklaces. Is that not in here? I could be mistaken.
Another one out of town? Okay. Where's the blacksmith, though? Can I use the table yet? I cannot use the we table. We need a secure way into Burwich Village. What's up, House of Kentai? Yeah, this is uh, this is one that chat made me buy. You see anything you like? Pretty good. You see anything you like? See Duncan, I did side with Duncan. Fucking find him. Have you happened to find my apprentice? Right outside the big cave area, north of the area where you built the bridge. Oh crap! Okay. Duncan. Right then. Set up shop, eh? Elemental damage, spirit, movement speed, elemental resistance, rapid strike. Oh, wow, okay. What was the game? Was it World of Warcraft? It was World of Warcraft, I think. It had a very similar menu like this, and you had to learn stuff, and it was... It was the same, it was white, green, yellow, you know, up in skill. And uh, you used materials and then you learnt more stuff as you went along. That's how you got your blacksmithing up or whatever. Looks almost identical to this, funny. That's the thing that I just uh, learnt before, yeah? Mm -hmm. That's actually a set. Alright, so light blue is a set. Coldstone. Yeah, make me some of them. Ooh. So I need more of these ether crystals and then a couple of chilled steels. Bring me back any blueprints you find. Hey, you don't you don't tell me what to do.
wait, this is back in the this is in the cave again, isn't it? Such freedom to travel between zones. It's refreshing. What I would like to do is disable move to, yeah, that's what I want to do. I just want to change that to move. I don't need any other attacks. Then I can do shit like that. How do we get um, boss monsters and stuff to respawn? Is that just automatic when the next time I start? Or do I start a new new game or continue a new save, you know, like you could in Diablo? Just start over. Hmm, I do need a weapon attack, I guess. Just load the game again. Gotcha. Cold one is either immune or resistant to my damage. The mana cost is going up. I noticed the number. The uh, this number down here is is going down considerably more than it was before. Kind of understandable, really, when you. Oh, really? Crucible mode is that unlocked for me now? That sounds fun. Got a cold boy. This may be problematic. Oh no, he's still taking damage. Never mind.
Ow. That thing's kicking my ass. Alright, so ether crystals are quite the pain. <laughs> Report back to John Bourbon. Oh, hell yeah. My, my man. My main man. One sec, though. One sec. back we'll do we'll hand in that quest and then um we'll go into the crucible mode check that out can i use the table yet that's the that's the real question have you found a rift get good work while you were gone i dug through some of the there have been warden crew Gunslinger damage. Uh, gunslinger. Gunslinger's jacket. Toxic effigy of blood. actually not bad. If I was lightning inclined, I might hang on to that. We'll get rid of that one, I think. Here's a chilled steel. Need a few of those. Spell woven threads. Burn, frost burn, electrocute spirit. Offensive and casting speed. Oh my god. Hell yeah. Plus 100 energy. That's fine. Alright. Exit to main menu. Yes. Single player? No. Main campaign? Crucible. Map. Random? Accept. Go. Starting at level 15, huh? Oh, I've got a time limit. Things are immune to magic.
Uh oh, that ain't good. It seems that I'm going to need some kind of other attack, huh? Alright, so time's up. That either means it's going to end or whatever bonus we were eligible for before is no longer relevant. the multiplier goes down i see so we're still on rank eight but we lose the multiplier i see i see am i getting xp for this wouldn't that be cool uh it doesn't look like i am He seems to be immune too. Fantastic. Right then, we need to initiate Ice Spike. That does a little bit of damage. Ow. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. So you do get XP. Just uh, right on at the end. Defense site. Create death chill beacon. Oh. Okay. Tributes. How many tributes you have earned at the Crucible? Tributes are currency that can be spent on various celestial blessings, defenses, and to resume at various checkpoints. You cannot have more than 100 tributes at a time. Okay. Okay. Ribbon of Vitality. Magic Metal. Experience gained. Okay. Okay. 
offer you my services, but I do not work for free. Tributes. What are my options? Need 12. Salvage, dismantle, transmute. Oh, that's my stuff from earlier, right? Keep the chilled steel. Let's put some of this away. Lightning Nova. That's the one that we had before. Give me that for a second. Now. Okay. Zippity zap. So what should I do here? Like, set up What's this defense site. I don't know. Inferno beacon. Oh, that costs five tributes. So this is, this is, we've reached a, a pause point. Level 10, right? We just continue, I guess. You've done well. Let's go. Need to put this back on weapon attack. And then this on lightning nova. There we go. And the waves obviously get stronger and stronger as you progress, right? Zapping me, stop zapping me. Oh, I'm in trouble.
Level 18. We may have to call it real soon. It's getting wild. Time. Multiple, maybe. Before you Nicholas Balthazar. Oh, we did ding. Okay, cool. Thank God. More spirit, please, if you don't mind. So more of that. Then we want some passives. Offensive ability. Skill Recharge. Adrenaline is a powerful force in dire situations. Battle Arcanists learn to use this to their advantage. Mm. <laughs> have I ever played before? No, I have not. Well, that gives us more damage, right? Inner focus. Aether damage. Chaos damage. Energy casting speed. Let's have a look at select class. What was the other one we were thinking of? Inquisitor? Elemental damage. Arcane Empowerment. Hmm. Maybe, maybe not. Dual blades.
Hmm. Not exactly sure here. Follow some guides. Well, we do have the tool where I can change on the fly, so that's... I don't mind at all. It's fine. Either, either way. Fifty-three cold damage. Can activate with all default weapon attacks when used with a melee weapon. Ah, uh, okay. That adds to a melee attack. Only one exclusive skill can be active at any time. start with that it's fine uh do we continue is the question it's getting tough getting real tough impressive but you've only just begun oh shut up are you ready for more let's try it. Pretty great. I do like that cold enemies or cold uh, aligned enemies uh, don't take damage from my attack. That's that's a nice touch. It's a poison. It burns. raising them. Um, and I did see that there was a bunch of different options for the arena as well at the start. So that'd be cool. Playing on different different ones. Oh my god, that's a that's a it's a Groot. Failed. Your compensation awaits in the treasure chamber. Optional. Speak to the master of crucible to reset the crucible for another attempt. I did level up though. Getting a level every single time we complete 10. That's pretty good.
300 energy casting speed. Energy cost. Yeah, that'd be a good one as well. Aether damage, chaos damage. That one I'm not sure about. But this is a good one. The crucible claims. We get all this stuff? Oh my god. And this was just for level 25? That's pretty good. No checkpoint available. It's alright. It's alright. Don't you worry. Sonic Seal, seal of Binding. I don't know what that does. Looks, looks badass though. Spirit Offensive Ability Required Physique 221. I am Lassad. Aether damage, spirit, energy regen, skill, cooldown, two to inner focus. So hold up. Ah, get it now. Cold damage, frostburn damage. Yep. Lightning electrocute. I mean, I guess we need lightning as well, right? Since we have that additional uh, zappy zap. Physique, spirit, offensive ability. Regen, speed, consecration. Sure. Isn't loot great? Reduced freeze duration. Vitality damage. Alright, well I'll probably get rid of most of this, I think. Oh, that will keep. Why not? Busy, cunning, cold, poison. Okay. All right, everything else can go, I think. Yeah, more, more zap zap. Attack speed. So can I sell what I don't need? Yeah, of course. Oh, I didn't even check this side. Lightning Bolt, 20% chance when hit. It's actually a nice sword, but I think we're going to hold out for this one, right? 
What do we need for that? 18 and 128 cunning. Next level. Alright. Still don't know what this seal is. And then these things I think I want to keep. woven threads those we need and put that on that oh this isn't cold is it it's lightning still good so granted skills it gives 10% chance on attack for lightning nova I assume that's I can still use it as its own skill is that correct whenever you deal damage right but do I is it only when I on hit or can I use it separately on hit only ah okay okay let's try again the crucible claims another Actually, you know what? Start. Let's see if we get a different map this time. Yeah. Oh, I don't know if I like it. More places to run. Greetings. It works, it really works. Fire fire demons and stuff seem particularly susceptible, unsurprisingly. Same guy again. Yep, same guy. Oh, he's stronger this time.
If I had a lesson, so I think that gives me the, the big top up that I need. You've done well. Welcome back, Brain Dead. game i'm again i'm really surprised that it i had no idea that it even existed gastrus the bell yeah no kidding see you that red corruption in the ground that's what killed me before with the tree i think he sort of trapped me there and I just took so much damage. It's like, uh, oh god, what was the curse in Diablo called? The one where it returned your damage to you? <laughs> it was a death wish every time. I wonder if there's a skill that lowers enemies' resistances. Penetration? Is that uh in the Arcanist track? Wherever it is, I'll go after it. Oh yeah, we're not we're not leveling as fast this time, that's for sure. Oh, I get to keep my tributes though. From before. So I could put something here, I don't know. Vanguard banner? Stonewall? Let's go inferno. 2500 iron bits, Jesus. Hmm, maybe that's not such a good idea. I can try it though. Each can be upgraded twice. Oh, okay. Ah, 
Ah, get away. Come stand over here. I didn't realize the range would be so bad. I'll just stand right here. Silverfish or something. And I hate it. Insectoid my ass. Look at the size of this fucking thing. Oh. Cool that they can't destroy my defenses. I like that. Oh, you trapped me just like Diablo does in a bone prison. Aren't you clever? Are you a frost guy? You're a goddamn frost guy. There you go. Just a little, just a little bit closer. Come on, bud. There we go. Good lad. It ain't easy being this cheesy. Incoming. Well, we got a giant burb. It's a problem. Things great. I want I want more. Oh. My health regen is limited. Not like this. What do you mean? Exactly like this, Sister Estelia. hurting me. I'm, I am corrupted again. Oh, I just got straight up nuked. Not cool, bro. Not cool. Can I wear this yet? Level 18. 
Did I get rid of it? Oh, we still need 128 cunning. That's climbing slowly by itself, I think. The crucible claims another. Go. Take your pit watching you squirm was enjoyable. Vitality and chaos resistance. Is chaos what just took me out? Well, no, I got zapped then. I don't know what, what by, but... Ooh. Epic pants. Throw feces granted by item. Yep. That's what it says. Reach into the seat of your pants and pull out something that is certain to alarm your enemies. Mark of Dreeg. Physique cunning. Oh. Was it 128? That won't quite get us there. Chaos damage spirit. Lightning damage. Energy regeneration, skill cooldown, arcane will. What is arcane will? Shoulder guard. Lots of like acidic stuff. Lightning damage, chaos resistance. I think I'm just going to sell most of that again. It's all right. Did we make it to 30? Oh, that was 30. I think we died on 30. Keep the pants. Well, might as well store them, I suppose. Is it one, two, three? Yeah, we're getting there as well.
casting speed reduction to attribute reply requirements. Interesting. Alright. I really want to get that level 20. We're, we're there soon. Storm Totem, Storm Caller's Pact. Oh, that's for a... Um, it says for Demolitionist. get a different map again oh do I get to keep my shoot Calorian well somebody did and uh, we jumped on it yeah do I get to keep my uh... no nah, it looks like it's gone hey my little defensive tower Oh, dang. Greetings. one's quite spread out. Um, I'm, I'm really enjoying it thus far. Don't die, don't die. This guy suck. I'm running out of pots though. Seriously, nothing has given me more of a Diablo 2 flashback than those those things right there. Again. 
Oh, he's level 22 now. He's definitely getting stronger as I get stronger. So that's going to be a problem, actually, isn't it? Because our... Even when we level, we're not getting that much stronger with that particular spell. Hmm. Unless we get the gear to compensate, I guess. What is the skull on me? What kind of debuff is that? Unlocked Monster Slayer. Hell yeah. Shit. <laughs> Gotta get those whiffs real fast. Oh, okay. Ladox. Oh, here we go again. Twenty seconds to defeat a wave. I guess that doesn't seem all that bad. Oh, 
Oh boy. Shit is heating up around here. Impressive. Almost leveled. Oh, they're all frozen? Oh, that ain't good. And they've silenced me. <laughs> now I silence myself. Sad display. That was cool, man. Come on, burps. That flame turret again, huh? Oh, is this the big scorpion again? Yeah. Does he continuously summon or summon up to a limit, I wonder? Okay. That's a lot. Down to 16 pots now. Spicy boy. Like, just uh, anecdotally, I would say that less stuff is resistant to electricity. Then frost? I could be wrong about that. Might be the same. Oh no. Time to go. them and maybe let Ross do the most. I know it's a little bit a little bit cold hearted. But you know what they say? Apple in the freezer is worth two in the dining room table. He's a cold boy too. And he is strong as shit. Bone chill. Yeah, no kidding. He 
takes no damage from me. Yeah, the debuffs do appear. I have to wait until... Uh... Oh, he's got some kind of uh, aura. Down to 11 pots. only 27 by the way it does damage like just gotta wait for it to sort of do its thing Another frozen guy? Yeah, probably. Uh oh. Oh shit. No, don't do that. Shielded. Yes, I can see that. Why? Misonak. Misonak is not playing fair. He's healing? What the fuck, man? Jerk. That's what killed me last time. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. The red, uh, so I gotta stay way, way, way away from him. Alright, we're doing this again. Did I level? I didn't quite level, did I? Gunslinger's jacket. We've had that before. Stormcaller's Spellblade? Now we're talking. Lightning, 58, 40, Electrocute. Wait, wait, wait. Chain lightning. Chance when hit. Ooh. And we get supercharged on there as well. It's pretty dope. 116 cunning. So if I put a point in here, does that automatically take me to 120? Comparable to something like PoE? I don't know. Never played PoE. Physique, cunning. Oh, there we go. Now I can wear it. Oh, I still need level 22 for that. Damn it.
Elemental damage. Pierce damage. Ten percent to all damage. Fire burn for seek. Minus 15% cunning requirement for range damage. That's pretty dope. What I could do... I could use the little... Um... second we lose my lightning nova altogether we would have to add it with uh, another stone that's fine the guys where's the guys can I make uh, no not here who was it who's the craftsman salvage Oh, you can salvage the... Got it. Keep item, keep add-on. Understood. Dismantle. Transmute. I think I need you. Cold stone. Yep. Let's make one of those. But we'll store that. And then we'll use the other uh, cold stone. Sorry. Uh, lightning stone in here. Actually, I wonder if we have those. Searing, that's fire. Chaos damage. Elemental damage. Ooh! Radiant gem. Level 24. And quite expensive, it seems. Lightning damage. Here we go. Electrifying weapons. No, that's not what we want. Cracked lodestone. I've already got some of those, though. Is there no upgrade to that? Yeah. 
Amber. Here we go. Oh, I need four ether crystals, but empowered lightning nova. Yes. All right. So we need one more of these then. Aether crystals, which I don't think I can just make, can I? Dynamite? So how do I get more of the ether crystals? Just from the... Out in the world, I guess, huh? Let's see if they've got any for sale. Campaign only. Got it. Did I get rid of my poopy pants? I did, didn't I? No, I stored them. Stone. Well, we'll put that on the other thing. Keep the rest. Let's get our lightning nova back. And then once we can wear that one, put Lightning Nova on that one as well. Or the Empowered one, because it's significantly stronger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, store the rest. Seems better. As does that. Still don't know what this is. So I wonder if we can trade them for something. Seal of binding. Is something else? Can't wait to use that. Next level. Who has electric skills? Crafting component.
Who's zapping? You look like you're zapping. Some unfamiliar. Lightning damage. Shaman has lightning skills. Okay. Blood of Dreeg. Does the shaman also get... Primal Strike. Two-handed melee. Two-handed ranged. Savagery. Torrent. Storm Totem. Storm Caller's Pact. Conjure Primal Spirit. Maybe a pet. Maybe a pet is the way to go. Lightning Totem's lit. Physique, Cunning Spirit. Health and Energy. Briar Thorn. So we could have a pet, a totem. Brute force, lightning damage, two-handed melee, ah, uh, two-handed melee, two-handed melee. Oh, that'd be a beast with a warrior build, huh? Devouring swarm. All right, let's start pumping points in since we want way back there. Corrupted storm. Lightning damage converted to vitality damage. Is that like a... So it, it would hit everyone. Nobody could be immune from that, I assume. Shamanator. Uh, let's go another. I've got four things here, so I'm going to exit to main menu. Yes. Let's go a different map. Oh. An indoorsy one. I like it. No real place to set up good defenses, though, huh? Yeah, not really. I need that little outcropping like we had previously. Oh yeah, one of these will do. Could run around. Storm caller beacon. Let's try again. And welcome to my crucible.
Oh, did I hear a doom? I'm dead. <laughs> the crucible claims another. You're gonna give me a reward for that? I deserve it. I worked hard for that. <laughs> No, same same place last time. I almost I die there almost every time. Alrex's flash freeze. You want to give me a bonus to that? Okay, that's cool too. Yo. thing on there as well. Oops, don't sell that please. Nice. N nice. Nice. The crucible watching Oh yeah, we gained about a hundred damage there. I need, uh, I need potions. Let's try not to use any, I guess. Hopefully I can buy them. Oh, there's a chance that we cast Lightning Nova when we get hit, I think. Maybe. Like zerglings. Oh, 
Mark of Pain. The Fiend's Mark snaps... Snaps your strength, I think it said. Alright, level 10. Getting stronger. Out. Shopping. Yeah, tonic of mending. Which does 25 plus 800 plus 25 over time. Is the same as what I got? Yeah. Okay, how much? One fifty. Like a lot. My rings kinda suck. What'd I buy that for? Original purchase cost. Thank you. That's very kind of you to let me do that. Seven percent are all damage. Nah, I should wait on that. It's a lot to spend, man. A lot to spend. Almost level twenty. Buy a totem thing. Could be a waste. Level 30 might fuck me up again. Very satisfying hits. I like it. Sick. 
16. That was lucky. Glad we saw them first. If they spread out too much, they get. Yeah, it's really dangerous then. Well, one thing's for sure, my mana can definitely keep up with whatever we throw at it. Dingling, level 20, eh? First things first, let's see what we can equip. This thing. Here's the question, do I want to switch to that? Storm Totem. Storm call is packed. We get a storm totem straight up. Uh, please hold. Do I really? Doesn't look like it. Because we haven't got it yet. So far away. Another, what, 11 levels before we even get there? Now I say we stick with this though. I should be using this shit. I can put that in there. That in there. That in there. Twenty pots left. Let's buy some more, maybe. All right, I'm gonna get a, a zap, a zap one this time. Storm caller. Vanguard banner. What is that? Grant nearby players bonus offensive stats. Nah. A bolt of chain lightning at a distant enemies that reduce resistances, but they hit a limited number of targets. Uh, what else you got? Defensive bonuses.
launch icy orbs at distant enemies, slowing their advance and reducing offensive ability. Damage is low. Hmm. Maybe we just go without. Impressive. So how do we deal with this final boss then? I think my AoE does small damage at least. Never mind. Uh, never mind. I just, I just died. Uh, is that a Pagrax raid I see in front of me? What's up, my dude? How you doing? Thanks for coming in. Hope you had a lovely night. Whenever Pagrax raids, I know I've stayed up too late. Let's have a look here then, shall we? Chaos damage. Yeah, um, fun game. Uh, I don't know much about it. This is just sort of the, it's called Crucible. It's like a, a never ending mode. Well, it's not never ending. It's clearly very ending mode. Um, and I will probably be going to bed soon myself, actually. I love having you here, dude. Thank you very much for the raid. Time to put that uh, 664. That's worth. Uh, try and, time to put that air conditioning on, I think. Impervious ribbon of frostbite. You don't say 8% frostbite damage. Well, see, now you have to go give me something like that. Although I'll keep this one because it has uh, like a skill on it, I think. No problem, my dude. Thank you very much for the lurk. Lurk? The lurk. And uh, you have yourself a lovely day. Happy Tuesday to you. Corpse dust. Cold damage, frostburn damage. The other one says 10% to all damage. Which would, in my head, say that they are better than what we're currently wearing. That, on the other hand... Although I will keep those. Offensive ability, health regen, bleeding resist. Hmm. Lightning damage. Uh, that was a bit of a wash, that one. Not a lot of great stuff in there, unfortunately.
What is this slot here for? Anyone know? Relic, All right? Well, I think that'll do me for tonight. I wonder if anyone else is playing this tonight, huh? Grim and Dawn. Let's have a quick look. If not, we'll find someone to raid. Still need. I still need a new game. I don't. I don't know why. I'm. I'm just all about. Ooh, Phantom Abyss had an update. Uh, trusty Mage, New Start, Sentinel. Oh, this person sounds like they know what they're doing. Let's go and visit Trusty Mage. When can you not trust a mage? That's the question. Twitch Whip Hotfix. Ooh, it might be in the game now. I will check that out in just a sec. All right, folks, let's raid on in. Thank you for hanging on out, as always. Um, I'm going to put a bit more thought into tomorrow's game. We got we to gotta play more Phantom Abyss, that's for sure. Yes. Yes, indeed. Thank you, folks. Uh, take it easy, and I will see you on the next Angry Joe show. Queeb. I'm McQueeb, not Angry Joe.